22 million. This is the number that just changed everything in the tech world. Apple didn't just order foldable screens, according to a massive leak from ET News, they secured an astonishing 22 million OLED panels from Samsung. The industry expected Apple to play it safe with 5 or 6 million units. Instead, they are going all in. This isn't a test run, this is a hostile takeover. The entire foldable market, Samsung, Pixel, everyone combined, barely sells 20 million units a year. Apple plans to swallow half the market in a single move. Form factor and price shock. This confidence comes with a heavy price tag, an estimated $2,400. This is an ultra premium device. So what are you paying for? Inside, a massive 7 and a fief 8 inch display like an iPad mini, but outside, it's rumored to be just 5.5 inches, smaller than the smallest current iPhone. In other words, a perfect iPhone mini for one-handed use that unfolds into a tablet. The critical question, is $2,400 worth it for an amazing large inner screen? If the outer screen is that small, Apple waited this long because they aren't copying Samsung. They are fixing Samsung's problems. One, the crease. They're using color filter on encapsulation technology. The polarizing layer is deleted and built inside the screen. Result, it's thinner folds cleaner, and the crease should be virtually gone. 2. Invisible camera. No notch, no island inside. A high-res 24 MP under-display camera offers a pure screen experience, making other foldables look like prototypes. The engineering gamble. Fitting a beast like the A20 Pro into a razor-thin chassis and keeping it cool is an engineering war. To win this war, Apple is taking its most radical risk, 100% eSIM worldwide. The physical SIM tray is history. Why? Because the space occupied by that tiny tray is vital for the foldable's massive battery breaching the 5,000 mAh barrier and its advanced cooling system. The big bet. However, this move is a nightmare scenario for giant markets like China and India that remain loyal to physical cards. Apple is betting 22 million units that the crease-free screen and legendary battery life will shatter this bureaucratic hurdle and user resistance. This isn't just a launch, this is the end game. Launching alongside the iPhone 18 Pro lineup, this device will be the undisputed headline of 2026. Apple didn't just enter the market, they waited to perfect it. The crease is dead, the camera is invisible, and the physical SIM is history. Apple just placed a 22 million unit bet that you will switch. Now the ultimate question remains, is $2,400 a fair price for perfection, or is Apple testing the limits of our wallets? Decide now and raise your voice in the comments. Subscribe now to catch the truth behind the hype. See you in the next one.